The further back you look in time, the more you realize how far we've come. That's the lesson taught by the career of pioneering female motocross racer Sue Fish, the 1976 and 1977 Women's National Motocross Champion. The earliest I can remember, I was three years old, my dad put me on the gas tank of his aerial and we went across the desert chasing jackrabbits and that was it. It was just a natural thing for me to be on a motorcycle or be on a bicycle. There was never any thoughts that I, I wouldn't pursue that. As one of the first female motocross racers to hold a professional racing license from the AMA, Fish raced head-to-head -head against male competitors and blazed a trail for future generations of women in racing. When I was young, I mean, I remember just idolizing Sue and because she carried herself so well. Sue kind of uh, brought a different level of commitment from the girl side, and I loved motocross. I was so passionate about it but yet girls were kind of put in their place. Well, Sue was racing against the, the guys in the expert class at that time and later on uh, in the pro class. And it just kind of gave me hope that, you know, this was something I could pursue and maybe do for a long period of time. Nicknamed the Flying Fish, Sue raced primarily in the AMA 125cc National Motocross Championship. In 1978, Fish competed in the Subaru International Motorcycle Olympiad, a two-day event encompassing all types of off-road racing. When I first started racing with the guys, definitely do not let that girl beat you. And I didn't care, you know, I just, I, I didn't care who I raced. I just wanted to race. It didn't matter to me at all. And um, uh, I learned pretty quickly how to ride aggressively because I didn't weigh as much as, as the other guys ride and I ended up on the bottom of the pileups a lot and that was it. I, I wasn't going to do that anymore. She is so deserving. She is a, a pioneer for so many women, not only in motorcycle racing, but just across the board. For the women who are racing in the sport now and, and women in motorcycling just really lets them see that you know there were people that came before that kind of set set it all up so they can take the ball and run with it now. It's an incredible honor. Never in my wildest dreams would I have ever thought that anything like this could ever happen in my life. All my idols are in there. I mean, I mean how fortunate was, am I to be able to have done that, you know, to have such a great career and have made so many lifetime friends and um, wonderful lessons and traveled the world just because I love riding motorcycles. The AMA Motorcycle Hall of Fame is very pleased to welcome one of the true pioneers in the sport of motocross, Sue Fish.